All right, so I did a ton of practice this morning, like several hours worth. Probably too much, honestly. Um, but we'll see. Hopefully I didn't over practice. That thing where you like spend all of your uh, mental energy practicing and then don't have any left for attempts. And I, I didn't even practice everything. Like I just practiced like two or three things. So it's not even gonna make, like, probably won't even make a noticeable difference in the run that I practiced, <laughs> you know, <laughs> such is the way. And I moved the input viewer so that if it goofs up, it's not gonna interfere with the, the game uh, capture. Like, I didn't practice Climb, I didn't practice Dragon. feel right. Oh, yeah, I was too low on the wall. Darn it. <laughs> so, series station is not something I practiced. <laughs> Grr. It sucks that, like, if you mess up the last room of series station, I feel like that's the biggest time loss on series. Like, just, like, good luck getting a good time if you goof up that room. So, I don't know, I guess I need to jump later through that door, probably. Because I, the problem there was I was too low on the inside wall. But this is, this is like the warm-up run, right? So just let all the goofy things happen. I really shouldn't angle in that situation. I don't know if it prevents uh, a ledge grab, but I kind of think it does. Alright, the climb. Do I lose 20 seconds? Or do I break even? Can we 
do do. Oh. I'm not letting myself get close enough to these walls to actually jump. Alright. Pretty decent climb for me, though. No glare today. Not yet. I'll have one in the afternoon, though. That was a bad fight. I like to think that these elevators are like segways in that uh just how you position your body I meant to practice the exit of this room Getting closer. I hesitated to try to get past that eagle hawk thing without taking a hit, and instead just ran right into him. Thank you. 
I always forget, so with your with your normal beam, if you're running you shoot a pixel higher, but with supers you don't. And so I always forget at that green door that you can't do the thing that I just tried to do. Hey, we didn't really have the HP to spare, but we got the damage boost. So it's kind of a problem because if I get touched by the pirates going into Kraid's Lair, um, Mini Kraid won't have ammo, which means I would need to reload that screen. This guy drop a big health. Drop the small health, which is not much. Like I don't think it'll help against these guys. <sighs> Could not get through this. So my only hope here is to get a little bit of HP off these guys. I had to get back over 50, and we're good. At least maybe don't want a damage boost there. So, I don't know. That was not great, but it gives us a chance to hit the quick kill. that wall jump and the timing is just all wrong in this room. Hey Mr. Greggy. How's it going? today nice which uh which category yeah that crate quick kill is finicky any percent oh no Okay, that was sloppy, but we got it. He's missing the frame. Yeah, I don't really have any advice for the great fight. Like, I've been really lucky the last few days. But I don't really have a good sense of what makes it work or not work. I 
probably shouldn't bother with that guy. And here, I think I want to shoot this and then charge. Kind of wanted to jump that guy, but oh well. Yeah, I do the missile setup. I fire one missile and then four supers, I think it is. Which is kind of costly ammo wise. I've never tried to play the Switch version. I don't know like if it's got any lag issues or anything. Oh, uh, what? Why didn't I have enough speed there? I did not want that waiver to block my my one super. Let's get a couple more supers. You want super? Yeah, um, any percent I find challenging just because uh, you don't have as many resources, especially at the end of the run. Like, this one is only dangerous up through about Wreck Ship Gauntlet. After Gauntlet, it's, uh, it's pretty safe. Falling a GT missile, yeah, that always sucks. Regardless of uh, what you were doing when that happened. wasn't graceful. Lately I've been jumping a little too early there and land, uh, wall jumping really low on the wall. Like, I guess it's better than running off the end of the ledge, but it's not great. I don't know what to do with that Alcoon. It's hard for me to switch to missiles fast enough to missile him.
I meant to switch to supers, but whatever. Oh. I was trying to buffer the input for that moonfall, but apparently that is not a good idea. Uh, what the heck? What? <laughs> just, just damage boost, Samus. <laughs> Why you gotta be difficult? Ugh. Yeah, that's... Oh. I saw that flash and thought I had speed. Of course I didn't have speed. Not that quick. Oh, what the heck? What is going on with my wall jumps? I mean, like, yeah. I don't know. I don't know if that's enough health for me at wrecked ship, but I don't want to. I don't want farm forever. And these guys are pretty good about health. How, how did I miss? I got like right up to it so I wouldn't miss. And uh, yeah. Well, we got my super back though. Oh yeah, and this strat, I have not figured out what grip to use for this strat. The shine spark here. charge. Ah. Yeah, I got all goofed up. Because I don't have a good grip for that situation. Go up the left. Or no, the right. Ah. I knew I was too high. Darn it. So I don't know. I don't know what position. I need to look at this in the practice ROM. Because I, I always hit that turtle when I have this beam combo there. So I don't. I assume that means I'm standing in the wrong spot when I shoot. But I don't know if I need to be more to the left or more to the right or what.
Buffer a shot at the tube down. Press a lot sooner so that you have more run speed to make. Uh, What? <laughs> I love how when I want a damage boost, I get a Kago, and when I want a Kago, I get a damage boost. I gotta get out of the habit of deselecting power bombs in that room. It's a hard, it's a hard habit to break. I was trying to use the automatic deselect version, but I got a little bit confused about which one it was actually on. Because it's also new, new muscle memory for me. when I go to run and she stands up. Just really easy for me to do diagonal inputs on this d-pad. But my other d-pad item select, or d-pad, my other controller item select is really flaky. Whatever select button is. And uh, it's kind of worse in some ways. Super is there, but I'm glad I didn't hit Pantoon. Oh, I thought I waited long enough. Guess I'll get lots of health here for the spiky death room. Not really. 
actually. Oh, it's because I have a reserve tank, so it didn't count as a health bomb. Right. I very well could die. Right here. Okay. Just go slow and careful. It's fine. <laughs> what did I shoot? I was too busy looking at the uh, item selection. Apparently I missed the door. I'm getting greedy with the pickups. Is that a guy that you can run through as you shoot him?
Dang it. I was trying to switch the power bombs and lost my rhythm. That one door bonk, and then, you know, the next room is completely ruined. Hey, Olive. You're a happy kitty cat, aren't you? Don't sit on the spacebar, kitty. That's that's for splits. Alright, I was trying to figure out the spot here. I think this is it. Nope. Really? Supposed to turn off Spazer, right?
Uh, I, I jumped early because um, there's, uh, there's a glare on my screen. Uh, I didn't... Uh, I didn't screw that up. It's a, it's a glare. Oh no, that wasn't a moonfall. almost good. That's not right. Oh, dang, that was right, but I didn't... Two of those could have been fine, but I didn't trust them. Have to remember Spore Spawn this time. Hey, we got that. That's cool. sure what I do wrong in that setup, but I'm, I think my positioning has been fine. I think it's the camera that's wrong. Hello, all of you came back. Somebody's a happy little kitty that wants attention. Sorry, kitty. Hey. 
Is that far enough over? Okay, good. Worth it to kill that guy. Like I'm pretty sure it's not. It's just gonna have it. That's not a moonfall. Hey, we got that one. That feeling when the the thing you practiced isn't working. That sucks. I think I got that second try in my PB. My cat is literally laying across my arms now. Like, it's actually kind of hard to press buttons. Olive. Why, why you gotta be like this, kitty? That's the controller. on the, the d-pad. You're a goofball cat. Hey! 
I don't know why I bothered to to do a tap on the first attempt. I just lost time with it. Dang it. I'll try this, but uh, no promises. I did not practice this today. I need to get better at deselecting grapple there because it seems to be actually awful. <laughs> or maybe there's a better way I can aim. But I seem to lose time trying to open space jump with it. Uh, 
I need some supers, right? How many do I need? I guess I just need one for the um, the toilet, right? So I guess that was fine. But I was so focused on not bonking my head that it just didn't jump. Oh, 
Okay, this is bad. Ugh. I spent so much time today working on short charging. And then, <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I over practiced. So now the left sand pit. How did I? I don't know how I got the other quick fall. Off the ice beam. Okay. Forgot about that. I meant to shine spark there, but 
I'm kind of bad at pressing buttons. I actually couldn't get the, the spark going. Uh, I guess I should have shot first. Come back, Olive. It's a lazy catter day, huh? For you. Didn't fall. I I did the baby strats though. I don't think I really need those. I probably shouldn't grab them. I don't know if I should be shine sparking there. It's probably slightly faster, but probably also not all that much faster compared to just getting a good run speed.
So I don't know if I want to bother with Wasteland Mockball on the way back. I practiced it a ton today, but I never get it, so... And this, this runs, like, a solid pace, right? So... I don't know that it's worth doing attempts on this run. Oh, he is dead. I was thinking to myself, like, he's acting dead, but I'm really not used to mixing charge and uh, supers. So I really wasn't confident how much damage I'd actually done. Because it's 20 shots with this beam combo, right? Versus 30 supers. Okay, yeah. And I think I hit him with 10 charge shots, roughly. Alright, so this room, I'm just... Any way I can get through it. We're not doing anything fancy. I didn't touch that guy. That's probably the fastest I ever got through that room. Like, out of randomizers and everything. Shame I couldn't get the power bombs faster. Can we gap skip? No. Gap skipping is impossible.
Okay, yeah. Spring ball is way less laggy there than what I had been doing. I need a faster strat to leave that room. Because running through this acid lava, whatever this stuff is, is really slow. I did not want to place that. I gotta remember, once I get Ice Beam, it's actually a bad idea to shoot that guy. Or use missiles. Remember to jump this time. Famous. Get, get on the ledge.
Wow. I'm consistent, but I'm not doing the right thing. Uh oh. Can we. Oh. Kinda fixed it? Like. By which I mean not at all. I don't know. Like. I'm, I'm used to doing Billy Maze at the start of the game and jumping up there, but I'm not used to doing it with all the items. And. I don't know, I'm, I'm like getting too much speed or something. I get too much jump height. Kind of goofs it up. I know that. Oh. Not this. Really? We're gonna lose time to that trick? There's almost no way I'm getting this, but it's good practice. Yeah, I, I'm i so bad about letting up on right before I press jump. I, I did like seriously 45 minutes of just training my muscle memory but not in that particular spot. I did it at wreck ship. But <laughs> it's not enough. Need more practice. I almost ran out of time on that, but this will be maybe a goal. Definitely better than PP. So I always screw this room up. I feel like with my run speed, I would have been better off hitting those spikes. All right, so last item. Sub-90 for item collection. That's pretty cool. I'm so bad at starting IBJs from the ground. And it kind of hurts me because I, I can't horizontal bomb jump because I can't do the timing. Thank <laughs> you. 
That's a huge time loss for a stupid reason. So that the first Metroid in that room, I think I'm supposed to hang close to the wall, and I ran to the far wall. I think that was my mistake. And then from there, it just kind of snowballed out of control. That's like 30 seconds lost for no good reason. I think I'm just going to take screw attack off. I've been practicing the short charge zip skip. But I'll save it for a run that's not doing as well. Stand up. So I did actually want that meatball to hit me, but then I almost got ketchuped because of it. Because <laughs> if that meatball hit me, I knew I would be perfect health for suing stand-up glitch. But man, that got dicey. Uh-oh. I almost ran into that too many times.
Uh oh. Okay. I started to hit that slowdown glitch, but fortunately I mashed item select and deselect and got out of it. I don't remember which one is the the one that actually gets you out of it, so I just mash them both. get a spin. Two twenty one. That I don't think I've ever beaten two twenty two. That might be my fastest uh, exit from the climb. Didn't let up on R in time. <laughs> oh God, Samus, Samus, please. This is a good pace. Don't don't ruin it now. Almost a one thirty four. Almost a one thirty four. If I, if I had just gotten a few jumps better, <laughs> thanks, Jubes. <laughs> I don't think Kuru liked my, uh, <laughs> my routing decisions. <laughs> now we get the long wait to see if it's actually Hundo. I mean, it's got to be because of my splits, but, you know, it's good to also, you know, see it. I'll have trouble beating this PB. A lot of things went, a lot of things went well for me. Like just, like in, like I'm, I'm not using optimal tricks, obviously, right? But, cause there's like 20 minutes that the experts can save relative to this, but it's still, for, for what I know, it's still really good execution. I'm verified you angle sparked in the animal's room. Yeah, I, um, so to do that, so, so to do horizontal activations in the air, the, the sort of trick is like hold R, uh, well, sorry, so, do a spin jump by holding a D-pad direction and press A, then you do R, and I think you're supposed to let up on A, let up on R, and then press A again while holding the D-pad direction. I don't know, part of it's muscle memory. But anyway, the thing I keep screwing up on is I'll, I'll let up on R and press A at the same time, and that causes you to do an angle. But if I would just let up on R and then A, it would be fine. But in but I I press them overlapping, and then I get an angle spark. And like you have you have like, I'm exaggerating, but you have like two seconds from when you press R to when you have to press A. So it's not like it's not like I need to be rushing it. Like I could tap it and then tap it, and the like I'd rather have the trick work than the trick 
work and be like, you know, half a second faster. Yeah, I think maybe this is a better spot for the input viewer than where I had it before. Because it's not covering up anything now in the game. I think the input viewer is mostly for me anyway. If I'm if I'm like, how the heck did I do that? Or why did that not work? I can look at the input viewer and get a hint. Oh, I forgot to look at my in-game time. I'm curious what times you have to start putting down to get sub-hour IGT for Hundo. But it'll be on the VOD. I can look at it later. Boom! 100%. Alright, so, 